Now you're wearing your My Hero shirt. We just covered that last week. Yes. Well, I feel like I have to represent for yes. uh, Two Heroes, which comes out next week on the 25th, available at a theater near you. So. And we were just at this theater, too. It's very deja, deja vu, eh? It is weird. Yeah. I feel like same place, different clothes is yeah. how that worked out. And you look yeah. very nice, by the oh, way. Thank you. Yeah. Uh, now, what's it feel or what does it mean to you to come to an anime film festival? Uh, it's pretty amazing, actually. I, I grew up on anime uh, before I even knew what anime was. Way back in the day, I used to you know, tune the UHF channel to just find these animated feet shows that I just yeah. had no idea. They were like nothing else. I used to watch like Kimba the White Lion. There was uh, yeah. something called Marine Boy Speed Racer, Battle of the Planets, like super old school stuff. And I, I, I didn't know what it was and I just knew that I loved it. Yeah. I just loved it. So I had no idea that later on my career would uh, you know, bring me to anime, yeah. which is amazing. So I've always enjoyed watching it. I've enjoyed working on it. Uh, to see it rising in popularity throughout the States is fantastic. Everybody knows what it is now. Yeah. And uh, more often than not, you talk to somebody and they're like, oh yeah, I watch it every now and then. I watch some or I love it. It's my life. Yeah. So uh, it means a lot. I think it's a, a great thing to celebrate. Uh, we could have a festival every couple of weeks, I think, and it would do well. Yeah. Yeah. So last week we were pretty busy on the red carpet. We didn't get a chance to talk to you much about the movie. If you could pick a quirk from My Hero Academia, manga or show or movie, what would you pick? Well, here's my quirk that I decided. It's not one that definitely exists in the show, but I think it's applicable to uh, today. Okay. Um, I would like the power to force people to tell the truth without knowing that they're telling the truth. Uh, so if your plan was to get up and say X, Y, Z, and you yeah. knew you were bending the truth, you would get up just as confidently and you would tell the truth. And it wouldn't be until people said, what did you just say? That you were like, wait, what do you mean? Uh, rewind the uh, tape. What was that? That would be my quirk, is to force people to do that. That's a good one. Yeah. Yeah. Always makes, true stuff always makes me think of Saga with the lion cat. Right. It'd probably be more fun to just fly though, but you know, whatever. Yeah. No, totally. <laughs> uh, and then if you could pick a sensei, who would you pick within the show? Within which show? With my, Within My Hero. My Hero? We're still talking about My Hero. Uh, I, I guess uh, All Might, I guess. All Might? Okay. Yeah, why not? Sure. That, would be a, that wouldn't be bad to uh, learn from All Might. Cool. Yes. And then, Is that going to happen now? Uh, maybe. Oh my God, that would be amazing. Yeah, but you kind of play the bad guy, so... Well, yeah, in this film, I'm yeah. the bad guy. But you know what? Uh, everyone deserves a chance to change their ways, especially in anime. I played a lot of villains who, in the end, you feel kind of bad for. Um, this is not one of those villains, but, but, yeah. no spoilers, you know. But, uh, but yeah, so second chances are good. Yeah, could turn my life around. And then, uh, briefly, if you could tell us about your character in the My Hero 2, uh, My Hero Academia 2 Heroes. It's a long title. Tell us briefly about your character. Well, I don't know. I don't want to spoil anything. Um, the film, it's a fantastic film, let me say first, and it was my introduction to the world of My Hero Academia. So when I watched the premiere last week, it was the first time I'd seen, I'd never even seen an episode of it. I had just seen the bits yeah. while I had recorded and heard about the movie. So um, I love it. It was a great film, and I'm interested now in watching the series. It was a great like turn on to that whole series. And the film actually is uh, revolves more around the main characters. The villain, if I, I mean, even though I play the villain, I want to build him up. He is just a device. There needed to be a villain in this yeah. one. So uh, I, there's nothing I can really say about the villain that wouldn't spoil something in the film, and I want you to just watch it and enjoy it. I can say uh, I was honored to uh, work on this, and uh, it was a blast, and I'm really excited for everybody to check it out, and hopefully you will enjoy it. I know you will. Nice. Anything else you'd like to add about the festival that we're at right now? I don't know. I'm just glad I could make it here. It was one of those weird things where you're yeah. working and you can't make it, and then things change around, and you're like, I can make it! Sweet. So I'm really honored to be here. So well, we're glad to have you yeah. here. Thank you so much. Great. Nice talking to you. Nice talking to you. Nice. Bye, all. Thank you for watching. I'm Carrie Lane with AfterBuzz TV.